Hey friends, I have another story for you today. This is by one of my all-time favorite authors. You might know him, Mo Willems. You might have seen um, Knuffle Bunny by him. You might have seen other Elephant and Piggy books. And so I hope that you will enjoy this story called A Big Guy Took My Ball. Before we start reading, I want you to predict. That means make a guess in your mind about what you think this story is going to be about. We can look at our picture on our cover for a clue. We can look at our title for a clue. A big guy took my ball is our title. What do you think it will be about? Maybe maybe the elephant is talking about this elephant being the big guy because he's bigger than him. Maybe. Maybe he has the ball and somebody else took the ball. I don't know, but we'll have to find out. It's okay if our prediction is wrong. We can just fix it while we read, okay? So, good readers always make predictions about what they're going to read to help them understand the story while we read, and we connect to our prior knowledge. That's the information we already know about something. So, I know that if a someone took my ball, I would feel how? Sad. So, how do we think our character is going to feel? Sad. Maybe. All right, let's find out. A Big Guy Took My Ball by Mo Willems. A big guy took my ball. Gerald! I found a big ball. And it was so fun. So how is Piggy feeling right now? He's feeling happy and excited. And then a big guy came and, and, and. He took my ball. So sometimes our characters' feelings change. How do you think Piggy's feeling right now? really upset. He's feeling really sad. He's crying. He is not happy. He's going to tell us. I am so upset. Look at his heart breaking. Oh, so sad. That is not good. That is not right, says Elephant. Big guys have all the fun. What about the little guys? So how do you think Elephant's feeling? Yeah, he's feeling a little upset too. He's feeling like he wants to, to help Piggy. He wants to get some justice. What makes those big guys think they are so big? Um, their size? Well, I am big too. I will get your big ball from that big guy. My hero. Here I go. Let's see how big this big guy is. How do you think he's feeling here? Still feeling a little upset or worked up because he wants to help out his friend. Do you think he's feeling brave? Yeah, brave is a good word that we could use to describe elephant right now because he's feeling like he's gonna go stand up to this guy. How do you think he feels now that he's seen the big guy? a little bit scared, a little less brave. How can you tell? We don't have any words on this picture, but how can we tell how he's feeling? We can look at his facial expressions, right? His body language. So the picture gives us a clue about how he's feeling. Uh, did you get my ball back? That guy is a big guy. You did not say how big he was. 
He is very big. He's bigger than I am. Much bigger. I am smaller than he is. Much smaller. There's a good connection to math. I feel like you've probably heard in math something is bigger or smaller than. Good readers make connections to what they already know. He is so biggy, big, 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 Gerald. You did not get my big ball back, did you? Uh, I did not. How do you think he's feeling now? Look at his body language. Maybe a little embarrassed, maybe a little sorry. You can tell because the way that he's standing, right? Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you for finding my little ball. Pages are stuck together. That is your ball, and you think it's little? Well, I am big. <laughs> so big that no one will play with me. How is this whale feeling? He's feeling a bit sad now, too. We've all taken turns feeling sad in this book, it seems. Little guys have all the fun. What does this statement remind you of from earlier in the book? Yeah, it reminds me when Gerald said that big guys have all the fun. So, he said, How, I can't believe that big guys get all the fun, but the whale said, Little guys have all the fun. So what do you think about that? What do you think we can learn from that? Let's see. Um, big guy, would you like to play whale ball with us? What is whale ball? We do not know. We have not made it up yet. With a little help. We can all have big fun. Is that what you guys were thinking when I said, what can you learn from how both of them thought the other one was having more fun? That's what I was thinking. It seems like maybe they should all have fun together. The end. That's the end of our story. So what lesson did our characters learn? Yeah, our characters had to learn that sometimes everyone feels a little sad, but if you work together, we can all have fun. I just love that book, and I just love Moat Willems. All right, I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks for reading with me.